What is good, guys? It is your coach of the Detroit Blue Flares, Kaz the Weave, and we are here with week three of the GBC against the Bork, aka the French Frogadiers. And today we're gonna go over our team that I decided to bring this week. Our match should be start starting pretty soon, and so I just wanted to go over something. So, firstly, let's start off with Dodrio. I decided with Dodrio that I'm going to bring. Again, Terra Normal, like usual, with Jolly Nature to make sure I can't get power crept, like power, uh, sped crept by that, um, Mimikyu if I decide to go Jolly Max Speed. Um, I'm bringing Knock Off because it's good on a lot of Mons. I'm gonna use that to be able to hit the Mimikyu. Ideally, he is not, um, in disguise still when I hit him with this Mon because I'm very frail. We also got Return, Quick Attack, and Swords Dance. So... Uh, and it's holding the Silk Scarf, funny enough. So, the the idea with this thing is to set up, ideally, on something that's not going to do too much damage to me. And click Swords Dance. So, with that being said, as long as the Mimikyu isn't around or is in range of a knockoff kill, I can just click Return on a lot of the big, big heavy threats like Guzzlord, Torterra, and do a good amount of damage. Almost, well, it's definitely two shots. Very really close to a one shot, depending on where their HP is at. Um, it just obliterates the, um, Salazzle, it obliterates the Watchhog, it obliterates the, um, Cricketune, you know, the Vaporeon, and then Knockoff I brought for the Matang, because it does have a Matang, probably EV Light, um, I can knock it off, it, it'll, it'll take one, and then Return will be enough to kill it, or I'm pretty sure another Knockoff does. So, that is our Dodria. And next, we got Dawn Fan with Leftovers. I gave him 252 in HP, 204 in attack, and 52 in speed because I, and I'm impish nature, impish nature, because I want to be able to outspeed Torterra. And the reason for that is I can get a nice ice spinner off if he's not Terra and do over half, and then I'll be fast enough to do it again next turn. He's also packing rapid spin because we don't like no rocks. All our toxic spice because he does have Salazzle. Um, sunny day because he's a beefy boy. Who had an extra spot. I mean, obviously, I could have brought Earthquake. Um, but Sunny Day for the Charizard. And Knock Off, because Knock Off is good against the Mimikyu, of course. And plus, just items in general. <sighs> so, that is what he's going to be for. And next, we have Smeargle. Once again, Rocking Spore. Healing Wish, Stealth Rock, Sunny Day. Um, I brought the Stealth Rocks this time. So, the uh, Stone Axe. He is uh, running Sunny Day as well. I can't remember what movie he had last week. But we replaced that one. <laughs> Healing Wish in case I can be able to get something healthy again, which would be great. And Spore because I did, did test it. I can Spore even when the Disguise is up. So it could be potentially live one hit from the Mimikyu and put it to sleep so I can get something else out there like a The Blade. Alright, and speaking of that, next is The Blade with the Weakness Policy. No EV Light this week. I have 188 in HP, 252 in Defense, and 68 in Speed. Because once again, I am building to power to speed creep that guzzlord obviously it's like oh guzzlord's only 40 speed well i'm only 35 so i need to make sure to be faster than guzzlord i am sacred sword shadow sneak rock slide and iron head sacred sword can two shot the guzzlord if i get that weakness policy off which is a high chance because he is a dark dragon type who likes to click knockoff ideally i get something in on something safer but his main job is that guzzlord and maybe the Mimikyu. His main job might be more the Mimikyu than that. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, he is impish. I want him to be very tanky. Uh, he didn't need any uh, attack because I'm going to get plus two if I get that weakness policy off. And I brought Rock Slide in case the um, Salazzle wants to try and substitute on me. I will break it right away. I needed I needed coverage because with this thing, he was a free, almost a free swap in for the Salazzle just to kill it. So I if I feel like... He's done what he can do. I click Rock Slide, and if he tries to substitute, then I'm burning HP. So that's that's what I'm hoping for. Next, we have our MVP so far this year. Our coach, or not coach, our captain, our co-coach. Charizard with the um, Heavy Duty Boots, Solar Power, Timid Nature. Of course, max special attack, max speed. He will not be able to outspeed the Salazzle unless for some reason he didn't fully make it fully speed, which there's no way he didn't. Um, I'm bringing Will-O-Wisp, which I decided to bring instead of Focus Blast because I basically decided that I think we have enough for the Guzzlord 
and the watchlog that it wasn't really worth the 30 percent chance to miss so will-o-wisp in case the mimikyu wants to set up on charizard i can get a will-o-wisp off it's also just good to will-o-wisp physical attackers um ideally charizard doesn't really have to click it but if there's a world when where he has to then i got it right there flamethrower scorching sands and solar beam uh, in the sun, Flamethrower one-shots the Mimikyu if it's not disguised, which I'm hoping for. Of course, Scorching Sand obliterates the Zalazzle, which is its two biggest threats. And um, as long as it has some HP taken off of it and it's not behind a sub, I will just take care of that. And I brought Solar Beam just in case the Vaporeon shows up. Also good if the Torterra is a Terra Rock type, which I doubt. But if he's Terra Grass, he still gets burned to death by my Flamethrower. Especially in the sun um the he just has this charizard has a good matchup against so many things if i had focus blast let's see how many things if i had focus blast for the will i could super effective against salazzle super effective against vaporeon super effective against guzzlord if i kept focus blast super effective against torterra super effective against matang super effective against Kratoon, super effective against watchhog and super effective against shell eight of his pokemon it would have a super effective move on and he has nine so, and the one that he's not super effective on, he can one-shot in the sun with a flame. So, Charizard's come. He, he is a... Charizard's such a good mod in this type of format. I'm very happy. Obviously, he has to have boots because it's not safe for him to go without his Yeezys. And, yeah, that's my Charizard. And last but not least, Galissapod with Leftovers. He was a, uh, a last-minute add. Uh, I decided instead of Ty Tyrantrum, which I was going to go originally, I think a uh, bulky... Uh, well, kind of bulky. Not really bulky. Okay, let me take that back. He he's naturally bulky, okay? But a Glissopod with leftovers, just in case I come in on the rocks, I can maybe get some back. Um, just to make him, help him sustain. We have 120 in HP, 252 in attack, 4 in special defense, which, actually, now that I say 4, um, you guys aren't gonna see it, but since the battle hasn't started yet, and I still have a little time, I'm gonna get rid of that special defense and put it back in HP. I don't know why it's like that. So, let's just say 124 HP, 252 attack, and 132 speed. The 132 speed is, once again, to outspeed the Guzzlord. Also, outspeeds anything that is, um, well, <laughs> he's the only one that's slow enough, because he outspeeds with 40, he, he is a 43 B, uh, base stat for, um, speed. So, it outspeeds the Guzzlord, which is good, because I can just leech life, and I end up winning that battle. Knockoff, because knockoff is a good move. If I have to fight the Mimikyu with it, um at least a little bit i can knock him off um if he i the worst part is i can't really sucker punch it because he can just swords dance shadow uh shadow sneak me but there's a chance but if not i just keep clicking knock off and we got the spikes because from my reviews he doesn't really have a way to get rid of rocks unless i'm not seeing it so getting double hazards up would be pretty nice on his team so i'm hoping i can get him in pretty freely get the spikes off and hopefully he doesn't really get any hazards on my side because I got the Dawn fan for that. And yeah, so that's the team, guys. I hope it all made sense to you guys, and let's get into the battle. See ya. What is good, guys? It is your coach of the Detroit Blue Flares, Kaz the Weave, and we are here with our matchup. And he brought the Mimikyu. He didn't bring the Guzzlord or the Torterra. He went pretty light. He went pretty light. All right, okay, I just had to make sure because he had timer on. I was like, wait, that's timer. On? Okay, he could very well lead Batang and try and get rocks up. Um, because he does go Matang. Do I go Smeargle here? But if he goes Mimikyu, I don't, well, it could be good. But he gets a sub up with Salazzle for free if I did that. Um,. I think we just I think we go Galitzapod so we can potentially lay out spikes or we can knock off. I think that's our safest play. But if we go so yeah, because if he goes to Lazzle and flamethrowers me, that's not good. Um I could also go Charizard because I threatened a lot of things, but let's go Galitzapod. Um just make sure it's recording. Good. It is the Mimikyu. As I feared the uh, Um Mimikyu right off the bat, huh? 
Let me click knock off. Yep, knock off. That did a lot of damage. Heavy duty boots. Um, he's gonna be faster than me, no? Trigatoon is fast. He could get. Let's get our own spikes. Yep. Spikes up. Um, now. I click Leech Life. Yeah, that's fine. Leech Life is done. I'm toxic. Lizapod scores the kill. Watch Hog is up. What does Watch Hog do here? What does Watch Hog do here? Does he set up? What does Watch Hog have? I'm gonna look up Watch Hog. Watch Hog Smogon. Um. Did have rocks. He could go knock off. I think we just click Leech Life. Return. Leech Life. Suck it up. All right. Let us go. Do I swap here? Mm. He could go return again for damage. And then I could go Dawn Fan. How much does uh, Max Watchhog all out attacker go against my Dawn Fan? He has returned as 36 to 42. I don't want that damage. I think I'm happy with what I've gotten so far. Yeah, let's just let's just clean let's just clean it up. Oh, we get a free swap. How fast is this thing? Uh, let me check my speed tiers. It is 60. It is 77. So it's faster than Smeargle. Um. Oh, I didn't test if Dodrio gets affected by this. I think Charizard's just a little free here. Let's go Charizard. I'm not affected. I can just click uh flamethrower here. Hmm, let's see what he goes. He might go back on the Mimikyu not expecting me to have will o -Wiz. Tang. He could have rock move. But the question is, does Mat does Matang scare me? Um Charizard. Okay, it, it does. It could have a rock move, I'm pretty sure. You know what? I, I almost want to look it up on a separate showdown just to make sure. But he definitely gets like Stone Edge, right? Or Rock Slide. Rock Slide. Okay, he does. Now, if I burn him, what does that do for me? Let's say for the worst case, Stone Edge. Just in case, if I burn him, he doesn't get Stone Edge. So if I burn him and then do, um, and he does Rock Slide, that'll do 57. But... Is that really a reason to get this guy killed yet? I don't think so. I think it's better just to spin here. Agility, interesting. Um, let us uh knock off right here. Meteor mash doesn't amount. That is gone. Health up. Let us rapid spin. He got the attack boost. Okay, he's meteor mashing here. But I just ice spinning here. He missed. That's unfortunate. Alright. Let us check my speed tiers again. Vaporeon 65. Uh, let's say non-invested Vaporeon, because I did put speed on my Dawn Fan. Vaporeon. Okay, I'm not fast enough, though. Water move incoming for sure. 
gold. Get a little leftovers back from him. I think knockoff is worth it here. I think knockoff is still worth it here. Yeah, okay. Get the lefties off of you. And I die. Now the thing is, do I let this thing scald? Does Vaporeon? Go Vaporeon. Dodrio. Return kills at this range, unless he's special if he's defensively bulky. Um, I just outspeed? I think this is free spore? This is free spore. Go Smeargle. Free spore right here. Do I click it though? I think I click sun. Free sun. You got the toxic. Um, no. I get my rocks. I just let this thing do what it wants to do to me. Put it to sleep. Swap out. Charizard. Mimikyu comes out. Roller powered up. Now I just click, uh... I just click Willow here. Will-O-Wisp. Sun's gone. Scorching Sand. Right to disguise. He Swords Dance again. That doesn't kill me. I'm just gonna click Flamethrower here. Yeah, that doesn't kill me. Good job, Charizard. I'm proud of you, my son. Okay. Does he sub here? Um. Is he? If he does sub here, what do I do? The Lazzle kills me from here for sure. The Lazzle on Charizard. Oh yeah, he can kill me with Sludge Bomb. So, hmm. what does he do here? Do I just let this thing go down? I have Solar Beam on this thing though, but my Dodrio does kill. In case he clicks sub, okay. Well, he didn't. Click Toxic. Okay. Do I just kill where, where I'm at with Scorching Sands at all? Vaporeon, Scorching Sand, does nothing to you. I bring you back out, Smear Goal. Mm hmm. Or. Um. Sunny Day. Healing Wish. Charizard. Probably me. That's fine. Solar Beam again. Solar Beam. One more time. You got the Toxic off. Uh. In case. Pull a beam. Nope. Okay. Hey, he will scald me here. I could just try. Scorching Sands, uh, if he's if he's max, it just doesn't kill. But I'd rather that. Oh, he he's doing that, okay. That's fine. We do this then. Mm-hmm. sunny day here. And now we swap out. Um towards dance.
Now terrestrialize return. There we go. All right, we got it, guys. Another win. Whew. Oh, he left. He didn't even say GGs. Well, GGs to my opponent anyways. It was a good match. It was not the easiest to prep, but we did have good answers in Charizard. Dodri Dodri uh, Dodrio had good uh, c uh, some good moves on a lot of his stuff. And yeah, so I think overall we prepped really well with the limited time. We made our team today and we played today, so... I'm very happy with it, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed the match, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.